no way. <laughs> no way I'm seeing this right now. <laughs> yeah! Yeah! <laughs> God, you know what makes me sad? I know there's people out there that don't know that reference. Stop. Some people don't know what that means. That is so true. This made my day. <laughs> Oh my goodness, thank you UPS for kind of, well you didn't really come in clutch because you didn't deliver it on time, but doesn't matter because we have everything we need for the 350Z. Fluids, got like a catch can, battery jumper, some more stuff we can use. This is not everything, is this part of the charging harness? Uh, I yeah, have, we'll I have the whole thing. Okay. Ground, uh, okay, I was gonna say, I have that, and then I have the rest of the charging harness. Let's see what we got here though. I have two boxes from them. Let's see. What in the world? They gave you a computer. Oh. That's cool. <laughs> I'll take it. <laughs> All right, Ethan, you ready to get into this little guy right here? Mmm, yeah. Looks nice. All the homies here today. What's up, Malik? What's up, baby? My dude, haven't seen you in a bit. I know. It's been a Got Cody, Ethan. I think today's the day, boys. Before we keep moving with this video, this video is sponsored by Raid Shadow Legends. I want you guys to forget what you think you know about mobile games. Raid has all the features you would expect to see in any brand new RPG title. It has an amazing storyline, it has great 3D graphics, giant boss fights, PvP battles, and more. Oh, and it's free. <laughs> <laughs> oh, big man's gonna get mad. Woo -hoo -hoo. Oh, he just ate, he just ate him. He just ate his old butt. He just ate a. Wow, he dead. Look at the detail you have on these champions right here. Raid's special launch tournament is happening right now. So go to my video description and use the link only in my description. You can get 50,000 silver to get you started. And the coolest part is you'll automatically be entered into their special launch tournament where you can compete with me and other players for crazy in-game prizes and real life prizes as well. Good luck, have fun. Make sure you use the link that I have for you in the description to download Raid Shadow Legends. Man, they gave us a lot of stuff. Hey, look at that. I got a drawstring bag too. And then a... <laughs> I can't say that I've ever seen that little guy. A, a thing, there you go, it's a little gremlin. A little troll gremlin. Okay, maybe it, the, maybe their mascot is the gremlin because like people say like when wires are like jumbled up, they call them little gremlins. Since um, I don't know anything about wires, Ethan, I'm gonna put this job <laughs> up to you. <laughs> you need help, I got you, bro. And then also we overnighted some parts from Japan, no, I'm just kidding, from Siki. It is a, wow, that's it. There you go, E. Power steering line adapter okay. for uh, from this to the GM. Yep, sick. Okay, we also Ethan. I I'm gonna let you use this today. It's an adjustable. Yeah, pretty pretty good stuff. I was like, we need this so we don't get caught. But um, I got you two 90s. Got 290 degrees, so we can go ahead and finish this up. Couldn't find the uh, the yeah. stuff for the Accu stump, so I think we might have to we might, go without that, might have yeah. to bypass it just for this event. But then it's not gonna be a big deal. Got uh, the front wheels and tires. It's been a good day. I actually have a 15% off, which is actually a big deal for this. I have a 15% off code you guys can use on this. I have it in the description, but if you need anything from Wiring Specialties, that's a big, big discount. Even with it like really, really nice like this, it still gives me anxiety it, looking at all it these wires. still looks a little intimidating, doesn't it? <laughs> it's like, wow, dude. Is, this is beautiful, but still like, wow. Well, it looks like some kind of alien organism just like growing on that. Would it not be a bad <laughs> idea? To no, I'm saying like I'll <laughs> Hot boy. Say say hot boy. Look at these wheels, dude. Mmm. 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 I love RSRRs. They're such good. They're such good tires to run in the front. We've got ignition. We've got literally everything um, ready to go. We have everything off the Z that we need, and we have everything for this uh, that we need. I have a very long shopping list that I'm about to go. Let me show you guys. It's a big list. Pretty sure it's one of the last trips we're going to have to make. I will say, guys. If you are planning on doing an engine swap, like, and you want to do it efficiently, effectively, and you want to get it done fast, you better have, like, thousands of disposable dollars that you can just go anytime and, like, get rid of because you spend a lot of money. <laughs> yeah, we are making some serious progress right now. So we've got the Siki power steering line that's going to adapt right to the power steering pump that we got. It's the GM pump. 
That's gonna be sick. And the power steering will officially be hooked up. We have officially done most of that. Most of the harness is actually in. We're now getting the starter wrapped. Actually, it's wrapped up. Malik got that figured out. Now we have to run plumbing. Don't think we're gonna be able to do the AccuSump again uh, just for this one event. The only thing else we have to do is uh, because I have this bent spindle, this bent uh, knuckle back here, I will have to either uh, shred some of that away so I can run the new CV axle or I might have to just um, take the boot back off and make it run or make it run without a boot for now just so I can have something but that does need to be replaced but it's not going to happen today oh wait where's it going where does it go bro where does it go oh my oh the <laughs> big flex <laughs> go ahead blow, blow it in there to see where it comes out <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah! <laughs> hey guys, it works! <laughs> All right, we're getting the spark plugs in, and um, so I have my MSD coil packs. I got a friend that's gonna be bringing some brackets for this so that we don't have to jank them up all over the place. It's gonna look nice. Got the water lines run. Oil lines have officially been run. We need to go ahead and connect the water pump to the radiator in from the bottom of the radiator back to the water neck. This car is going to start very soon. I'm not gonna film much more. It's just gonna be really small stuff. We're gonna make it look a little prettier than it does right now. It's a little bit ugly, but the main focus today is to make sure we get the car running because that's just the most satisfying thing after you do all this work, hitting that boom. So okay. while we're finishing this up, I want you guys to say hi to somebody. I've actually, I followed Alexi for a while. I actually used to like watch you like oh, in high school. Hi, <laughs> I, just, I, I just got here. We arri arrived about 40 minutes ago at the airport. That's awesome. So this is Nari Aro. It's so, a truck. I know you, I was gonna say, you, you just got here. Like, what are your first like impressions? Look at this huge truck, but <laughs> apparently it's a small truck. <laughs> hey, when it finally starts, we're digging in. Okay, we went with the minimalist approach and put eight quarts in. Oh yeah, yeah, okay. Um, it probably it needs about 10 to 12. I would say with the accent, probably like 12. We're starting it? All right, we're going up. It's we're gone. almost starting it. We're going, we're going no, we're starting it. You gotta think about it for another couple minutes, <laughs> but like, yeah. Last second stuff. You can power the alternator, or ground to the alt power. What are you doing right now? Powering the starter from the alternator. Got gotcha. you. Uh, let's see, did Evan plug them in right? Yeah, They're plugged in correctly. They don't. They don't necessarily bolt in really, really well, yeah, but, but they're there. Okay. okay. Battery's hooked up. What are you? This is oh, charging. Starter right there, yeah. Yeah. So okay. This to... well, I think you need to go. Ahead. <laughs> nope. That seems fine. <laughs> That's fine. This is about to be very loud. Yeah. Here we go. Oh, you're for you're for real. Oh, okay. That was like, <laughs> man. So it's been a little bit. We uh, figured out that there was a little bit, little problem with the starter and like the factory charge harness. And so we just went ahead. We had to make a few trips to the store and uh, crimp some new stuff, make some new wires. And hopefully crossing fingers, that was going to be our issue. And say hello to our engine builders and our, <laughs> our team. Can't get it done, so. <laughs> <laughs> crossing fingers. <laughs> I'm either gonna go nuts or I'm about to fall asleep depending on what happens just now, like right now. Okay, that's that's fuel. I hear fuel. No cranking though. I don't think we're connecting yeah, detect protocol failed. I mean I'm I'm hooked up. I'm not connecting to the ECU right now. <laughs> Gather info. Not not getting connection to ECM. Cannot connect. So ECU has no power? That's what it seems like. Okay. It was it was a running and driving car, yes. Thing. So um, it's been a long time. We long story short figured out it, might, it was a it was an ECU thing. It sure seems that way. I mean, so, I, I was not able to connect to the one that we were sent, and I definitely just connected to my Camaro ECM inside yeah. of. He took his ECU out of his F body and is now in here and you have HP tuners loaded up and it seems like it might crank. Nothing. It still doesn't crank, but. It's clicking. That could just be like. The relay's still out. Oh, yeah. Oh, okay. He's me out. That's good, that's good. You had us, guys. Y'all had us. Yeah. 
Oh, that's fuel. That's real fuel. That's fuel fuel, yes. There's not a crank, but still an angry relay. So like there's a bunch of things reading, you know, intake air temp, colon temp. That's good. Intake manifold pressure is reading incorrectly because we have the LS3 map sensor, not the LS1 map sensor, okay. so I need to change some scalers for that. <laughs> But that's not going to stop it from cranking. So, I mean, we definitely have connectivity to the ECM. It seems like maybe if we just go jump the starter right now, like, it sure. probably will it would do crank. something, yes. I would say start it, start it, and then immediately start lowering it down. If it, if it starts. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. But now we do have to figure out how in the hell to get it to start. Yeah, it's that's not a problem. It's a button. That's not a button. Yeah, that's, yeah. that's like okay. a 10 minute yeah. well, Now we can like go to home and like go to sleep and you know, not like feel like, oh, what happened? Isn't pizza coming? Oh, I don't know. Is it? Yeah, I'm pretty sure it is. <laughs> Thanks for your help today, bro. That was the, um, that was the, the, the next wave of energy I needed for tonight so I can go home and edit this video. That sounded sick. Actually, it wasn't that bad. I mean, I know obviously we weren't getting on it or anything, but like, I'm excited tomorrow. So like, once we have water going through it, like, oh, true. You know what, dude? Come here, where's it at? Pop them. Where's it at, dude? I don't even, <laughs> cheers, cheers, dude. Mate. This is how you end the day. <laughs> um... <laughs> This is a unique yes. setting here. Yes. We're, like, we're gonna sit right here at the bay door, <laughs> open our pizzas. <laughs> okay, so it took me about two hours to get home because of traffic, oddly enough. So I got home in like 12.30 or 1 a.m., was way too tired to edit or end the video. So I will say that it was a weird issue with the ECM. Um, wiring Specialties is gonna be sending us a new one that we can go ahead and reflash. So, so big thanks to them. That was the last piece of it. Next, tomorrow, it's gonna get crazy and then we do have a hectic weekend for you. I guess my daily advice to you today is um, whatever you're doing, it might seem complicated, but don't give up. Simple enough. Love you guys. Peace.